Finally got a chance to review the Volare pickleball bag. Stay tuned. So Andiamo, everybody knows him. Julian Arnold, love him, hate him. He's a firecracker of a player. Love the guy's energy. I would hate playing against him myself because a little Andiamo just makes you angry. Let's talk about his bag. Uh, this is one of the softest bags I've ever reviewed. And it is just uh, the material they're using here uh, whatever material it is, it is a soft, almost like a suede feeling. It's not suede, it feels very water resistant, but it is a very soft bag. So I just kind of like touching his bag. It sounds weird, didn't it? Okay, so let's just go over the features of these bags that I noticed right away. So plenty of storage for this guy. So you got a side pocket here. This feels very nice and sealed. So you can put your, your wallet, your keys, your stuff here on the outside. And then it's got the compartments here on the side that are, there's my Volare Mach 1, Forza. See, it's not, um, it, it's thick, so it's got a padding. It's not the insulated uh, type that you would put like cold storage, something like that, but because of the thickness of this and the lining here, it has a pretty good seal. It's gonna keep something, you know, in, in more even temperature. So not extreme heat, not extreme cold. This, this will protect your paddles in here. And it's got one on each side. So plenty of room for three, four paddles if you have them. You know, if you, want, if you have things weighted differently for like your singles game versus your doubles. Here in the back, we've got the shoe bag and there's my Selkirk shoes. And uh, one thing about the shoe bag I like is that it's sealed from the inside so you don't get that stank. You don't get the stank inside your shoe bag, but it's got a nice fish net here. So the air will breathe and get through this fish net here and it, the stink will come outside the bag. It won't get funky in there. You won't get no mold growing between your toes because you can, get, you can air it out. On the inside, there's bags. So you got plenty of zipper area here and little pouches that you can just stick things in. And these pouches go all the way through the bag. So like you can, you can put something all the way down here to the edge. So a lot of room for you to just dump stuff in. So you could have your socks, your headbands, your wristbands in there. And then on the other side, it's got a zippered one. And this one here goes all the way across the bag. So you can get, look, I can put my whole arm in there. And so a lot of side storage in this thing. So I, I was very impressed with that because I got a lot of gear. Um, and so as a, as a travel bag, this is great because it's not that heavy, really good thick backpack straps. So I, I, nice padding here. So when you wear this on your back, it feels nice on your shoulders. So if you have a heavier bag, this is really cushy here. Really strong handle. This is a padded handle. Now the only drawback on this is that there's no wall hooks. Uh, you know, some of the bags have the little hooks that you can just hook it on the fence. This one here, you can do it by the handle, but you'll have to have your own hook. But overall, I think this bag is a, is a solid bag. It's $119. With our discount code, you get um, the 10% off over there. And thank you for using our code. That helps us keep the lights on. And thank you, Volaire, for sending us this bag. Uh, it's a nice bag to carry around. I definitely like touching it. So appreciate you sending us that so we can uh, review it. But obviously, if you don't like this bag, you like other brands, I've reviewed multiple brands. Check out these other reviews if you want to see them.